The woman was showing off her new car to her husband, but just as she was about to turn on the ignition, a strange countdown popped up on the screen. As a bomb disposal expert, the woman immediately realized something was wrong. The husband wanted to open the door to ask about the situation but was severely reprimanded by his wife who told him to look around the car to see if there were any suspicious signs. At that moment, she also found a blinking red light in the car. She picked up a car gently scratched in the middle to confirm that there is no connection line after. The woman carefully opened the storage cover did not realize that there is actually a circuit board inside. Sensing something was wrong, the woman hurriedly told her two children not to move or their lives might be in danger. At that moment, her husband also sent him a message about the undercarriage of the car, and it was obvious that a bomb had been installed under the car. The woman recognizes it as an anti-tank mine and it's powerful enough to destroy the entire building therein if detonated. And from the looks of it, it's also a multi-purpose mine that could be detonated at any time if the weight of the vehicle changes, which means they're trapped in the vehicle. Realizing the urgency of the situation, the husband called the police and the woman immediately contacted her colleague, Mike, whose company specializes in bomb disposal. She explained the situation to Mike as quickly as possible and he didn't let her down and drove to the scene in just a few minutes. Seeing the complex devices in the car Mike instantly realized the seriousness of the matter. He quickly took out the detection equipment to carefully survey the situation around the bomb. However, when he was detecting the bomb, he accidentally found his company's nameplate on the bomb. Thinking that this may have something to do with the company, the husband hurriedly dialed the boss's phone. But to his surprise, the other party's ringtone suddenly rang in the trunk. It turns out that the boss is also locked in the car and he seems to know nothing about this incident, which makes everyone confused. At that moment, another technician also arrived at the scene and brought more specialized detection equipment. After scanning the device, they were able to find the internal mechanism of the bomb. At this point, there was a difference of opinion between the woman who thought that cutting the blue wire would stop the countdown and Mike who thought that the yellow wire was the timer. The blue wire was the main wire and the green wire was just a decoy. Although Mike's analysis was sound, the woman insisted that he cut the blue wire. Mike knew that Laura had lost her mind in her fear for her child's safety. Seeing the countdown coming to an end, he defied Laura and sent the robot to cut the yellow wire. Realizing that time is running out, Mike rushes under the car, ready to risk his life.